Hey there, I'm Joel Lightcatcher, and I want to see you in the air, in the air flying your own FPV drone, or as we like to call them quadcopters. I've created the Beginner's Guide to Building Your Own Drone, and I'm going to show you some scenes right now. So stay tuned, and I'll see you in a few minutes. It's time to wire up our video transmitter to our camera for video, audio, power, and ground. Let's start with the video transmitter. Looking at the bottom of the video transmitter, you'll notice the notations, power in, ground, audio in, video in, ground, and five volt power out. The five volt power out is the white wire, the ground is the black wire, the video is the yellow wire, and the audio is the green wire. Following the wires from the video transmitter, we'll have the five volt wire, the ground wire, the video wire, and the audio wire. I place all this on a piece of black tape because on this side are the wires from the camera and they are the video wire, the power wire, the ground wire, and the audio wire. You'll notice they are not in the same sequence. What we need to do is snip these wires off at both ends and solder them together in the right order. To do this job, we need our diagonal cutters and our wire strippers. We're also going to need a few pieces of shrink tube to fit these wires. We begin with our diagonal cutters. Simply grab any of the wires and snip off the ends. Just like that. Cleanly just cut the wires off. We need to start stripping just a little bit off of each wire. That's good. Come back to the other side. Always oh, strip the video transmitter wires. Some people like to use their fingernails. I prefer strippers. Okay. With a clean shiny tip on your soldering iron, let's just tin these up. Be sure you don't melt the casings of the wires while you do this. Twisting the wires, because we don't want any frays. Tin the wires on the camera. Very good. Take each wire and place a piece of shrink tube over it and slide it down so the ends are sticking out well. I'm starting with the camera, but it doesn't matter if you start with the camera side or the video transmitter side. These are the wires for the camera, and please notice how I have the shrink tube all the way down with a good amount of wire exposed for soldering. I'm starting with the black wire, and I'm using my helping hands to get those wires where they need to be. And I'm just going to supply a little heat, and the tin that we've already got on the wires should bind them together. And you can see that's a good joint right there. And now solder together the video wires, the audio wires, the odd wires are the power wires. The video camera is red and the video transmitter is white. And we now have power. Now that we've got all these wires soldered, take the shrink tube and slide it over each of the connections. So nothing is exposed. Your wiring bundle should look like this. Black to black, yellow to yellow, red to white, and green to green. Take your heat gun and shrink down your tubes.
Those shrink tubes should not move now and all those wires are insulated. Your video transmitter and video camera are now fully connected for video, audio, and power. Welcome to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed yourself and learned something today. If you did, please leave a comment below, introduce yourself, say hi, and I want you to meet someone. That's Ed. Ed's my assistant. When you click on Ed's head, you subscribe to this channel because I put out fresh quadcopter videos every week. And if you subscribe, you'll know about it. You'll be the first to know about it. Until next time, I will see you in the air.